Chess friends, how are you? DeepMind has released Alpha Zero Chess in 2017, but Alpha has created a completely new version called Alpha Zero version number 18. Today Alpha played an insane chess battle with Torch Engine where he sacrificed his queen. When you believe in a thing, believe in it all the way, implicitly and unquestionable, so let's go, Alpha started the game with e4, we have c5 knight to f3, here you can play knight f6, d6 e6, even the dragon Sicilian or a6 move, we have standard line d6 so, Alpha strikes the center with d5, takes knight f6, black can play e6 to build pawn chain to prevent the light square bishop attack, knight c3, a6, I always say that this a6 move is very important in most Sicilian variations, bishop e3 and torch played e6. To defend his light square diagonal, alpha played insane move g4, he wants to attack the kingside by extending the pawn and engaging the rook, so we have h6, queen f3 queen c7 h4, alpha is very serious here but torch successfully posts his knight in a good square, so bishop here knight d7 to go e5 square, Alpha played long castle, b5, outstanding choice, black want to attack the king in queen side where alpha is focusing to attack in the king side, the game is gradually becoming interesting, g6 f4, knight c4 to target the bishop, so we have bishop knight exchanges, and now alpha is threatening to win the pawn, but black ignored it and played rook b8, because he knows that if you are a good player then you will not take it because of b4 move, then the b file will be wide open, this is the reason why alpha pushed the pawn, b4 and we have pawn exchanges b4, torch wants to light up on b2 square and the queen is coming there, I actually don't know why his name is torch, maybe he's a double battery. Ha ha ha, we have b3 knight backs king to b1, inferior human gotham if he had played chess with black pieces he might have taken the pawn, let me show you the variation, then after takes takes we will play knight d5 to fork up gotham pieces, he might jump over his chair in shock, but in our actual game, black is torch, fortunately he have at least 3000 ratings so he played bishop e7, people are stuck on 400 or 2400 elo rating but when you go to artificial levels, these elo levels are a baby in front of me. I want to play knight d5 to fork your pieces, so torch turned off his light and reversed his rook, he is threatening to take the pawn because of this reason which is why alpha played f6, bishop f8 and look at the black position, alpha learned from my videos how to restrict opponent position and he applied it in his game, that's awesome, whose videos you watch on youtube will determine your future, if you watch chess memes then you will become a memer, if you watch gotham chess videos then you will become a joker or chess commenter, but if you love to watch stockfish videos then you will become like stockfish, that's the whole thing, here if you play a4 with the idea of checkmating white, then white will sacrifice the knight himself, but the irony is that the queen is under attack, so queen backs knight takes takes, queen takes pawn, knight c6 h5 and that's it, white is completely winning here because the bishop is coming there, the rook have open file and the another rook is ready to add pressure on this rank, let me show you the variation, if you take the pawn then we will take the pawn, take and this is coming, then we will sacrifice the queen by capturing the rook. King takes f8 rook h8, check and it will be a mate. Do not go where the path may lead, go instead where there is no path and leave a trail, so back to the position, Torch is a smart guy enough so he moved back his queen to protect his army, Alpha Zero is a brilliant guy, he defeated chess grandmasters in 1 vs 8 mode including Magnus, several times we have e5, Torch is just trying to open his center side, e takes d5 and alpha wants to play knight d4, b5 then knight c6 because the pawn is pinned, torch played king d8, knight here and we have knight a3. Rook c1 bishop takes pawn and alpha played knight e4, sacrifices the rook, if you were playing as black, you might take the rook, let me show you the variation, then we will simply capture the a3 knight, bishop takes bishop isn't possible because of this queen checkmate, so bishop f5 to protect that square, bishop b6, what an outstanding brilliant move, this mate incoming so rook e8 to protect it, queen d6 check, the queen is paralyzed so she can't move, you have to move back your bishop, then the killer knight will come to target the bishop, checkmate is unstoppable, you can't stop checkmate, 
And if you doesn't find the checkmate pattern then you are worse than a 69 LO rated player, so chess friends, if you want to become like me then you can like and subscribe to my YouTube channel where you will get amazing chess contents. So here Torch played bishop b5 to target the queen but alpha 0 didn't safed the queen, he takes the bishop and sacrifices his queen. We have bishop takes d3 and knight c6 check, humans will think of playing king e8, let me show you the variation, then we will simply capture it, and black position is totally restricted, alpha will get great pieces combination and open rook file, ok knight b5 rook c5, knight backs knight takes pawn, targeting to the queen with knight support, so you has to play queen b8 to protect the knight, then we will capture it, and after some moves later, we get this position where black loses the game completely. Takes takes and checkmate. Chess and life is a succession of lessons which must be lived to be understood, so back to the position, if you dare to play king d7, let me show you the variation, then after few some moves later, we will capture the center pawn with the crazy knight support, black position is totally surrendered by white pieces and he can't do anything now, we will do some pieces exchanges, exchange everything and at the end of game, alpha will get 3 pieces for, for one knight, so back to the position, black sacrificed the queen too. So wish you all the best thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.